Don't forget to subscribe, drop a like, drop a comment, share with your friends. All right, guys, enjoy the video. After being heartbroken yesterday, losing a seven pound bass, I'm going to unleash some frustration on some fish today. Big giant treble hook. That's 50 pound monster Zilla braid. 50 pound or 60 pound braid on this one. Uh, spider wire on my uh, my pen pursuit and my little Daiwa. I got the big meat sticks today. I just picked up Gomer Pyle. That's him right there. He don't like being on camera, but I told him I'm gonna put it on there anyway. But we're gonna go out there and we're gonna try to get some. Show you what we're doing. Hopefully this plan comes together. Look what I just caught. Oh man, that's crazy. It's got the fins attached to it and everything. Wow, that's crazy. Ugh. Sorry about the wind, guys. Out here trying to see if I can get anything. But they all kicking up mud and everything. Ah. Hey, get the net. Holy, this is crazy. Oh my God, hurry up. I'm gonna try to pull him up. Wait a second, wait. No, no, no. Come on, come off. There we go. Get off this freaking rock. Uh, okay, there we go. Yep, try to get him. Damn! Oh man. Dalton! He's barely hooked. You're gonna have to get underneath the head. Okay, the head's right there in the front. You're gonna have to get right underneath the head from the from the beginning. Okay? Come on. Oh my God. Oh. Check out the scales on these things. It's eventually, he's gonna break this damn braided lawn. Come on, please. Yeah, maybe if I can get him to move back this way. It's right against that rock, that lines are break. I'm just gonna have to wear him down and hopefully he don't tear my line. That's what he's, I'm telling you, that's what he's gonna do. That's a huge one. Oh my God. Hey Dalton, come over here, hurry up. Here, look, you're gonna have to get the head. Wait, 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 he's about to go nuts again. Hold him in the neck. All right. Oh my God. God he got sc scarred up off that uh, concrete. Holy <sighs> <Holy> shit. <laughs> few of them, but this is definitely by far the biggest one I've hooked. Jesus. I'm gonna have to get a scale on this dude. A drone that was bigger than that, only about 35. Yeah. But then again, I didn't also didn't fight him, so. <laughs> I'm trying to see the hell, how the hell is this shit gonna stay in here. Shit ain't gonna stay in there. Yeah, it will. Come on, man. Wait a second. If I can get it. How much you said? I said in between 26 and 30. Hey, you got it right. It's 24. 24. 24.5. 24.5. So that's what the tags will be? Well, I would look I would look for this pin first. Left me. That's my pin right there. Huh. So what do y'all so what do y'all do with like when y'all tag them? Put a number on that um that tag. You can oh. call it or uh put something in the office up there. Awesome. The mailbox, just put it in when you caught it and uh, where you caught it up. Awesome. See I would let him go, but I, I like I said I don't want a ticket. No, that's fine. Leave it up here. Oh. 
<laughs> I know. Even if you catch a tag one, if you let us know where, when you got it, we can see how long they live in. Because I think they all die eventually. Oh, yeah, because this water is so shallow, shallow. You see a lot of dead we ones up in there. There's a bunch of them in the spillway. There's a bunch of them, but um, once they get into the lake, it's the water's too salty for them. Yeah. People were worried they were going to take over Lake Pontchartrain, but I don't think they got to worry about it. Yeah, no. That's I guess that's. Fisheries let us tag a bunch of them to see if they ever get out into the lake. Yeah. Which, uh, when we have a spillway open. Wow. I wonder how big, uh, what's the biggest one you got out of here? Oh, shoot. We've got them two or three stones at uh Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I'm shitting myself watching him. Like I said, I'm riding past. I'm like, I'm surprised you caught him on that um, thing there. Yeah, I've got a big treble hook. This is the same thing I use for paddlefish. I use that for paddlefish, but I don't keep the paddlefish. I let them go. Yeah. I got We get in there with a big seine, and we just, uh, we kind of corral them. Yeah. Like, up against the shallow water. Oh, no. Kind of jump out and everything, and they're, they're hitting us. <laughs> oh, he was, believe me, he was hard enough. Yeah, we've got about 60 to 80. Man, it was so crazy. Them fish are some of the hardest fighting fish I've ever fought in my life. My All my forearms are still sore. This happened a few days ago. And man, it was just crazy. They were jumping all around, smashing their heads into the concrete. Friggin' crazy. We probably hooked up on at least on a, at least 25. We probably hooked up on 25. I didn't get all of it on film. Otherwise, it'd be a lot of a missed fish video. But uh, man, they get up in there. Uh, they got them little concrete columns and they get like a zigzag up in there it's almost impossible to get them out especially like i'm fishing with heavy braided line i'm thinking my it's getting rubbed on the rock and i'm thinking it's about to get cut so man it was it was stressful i had to stick the pole way out like this and get it around the rock and everything man it was wild but uh definitely definitely recommend it didn't fish fight so hard and i don't know if you could have heard what the guy said, he, I asked him, I said, was this a big one? He said, no. He said, we've caught them three times the size of that. They was catching 80 pounders in there, but they go through there with like a big a big net and scoop them up. So, uh, man, that's that's wild. If I would have hooked the 80, there's no way I would have got them in. But uh, I'm going to figure out a little bit better way to get up in there if y'all like this video. So uh, let me know what y'all think. Hit me up. Make sure to subscribe, like, and uh, tell your friends about the channel if they like fishing. Tell them to subscribe to me. That's what helps me out. Thank you. And see you later.